It's curd box time. We're having fun with this month's theme, salt and pepper here. Inside your box, you're gonna find cheeses and pairings that celebrate the dynamic duo, salt and pepper. First, let's talk about the cheese. Let's start with a delicious cheese from Beehive Cheese called Sea Hive with a sea salt and honey rind. Brothers-in-law Tim Welsh and Pat Ford make this quintessential Utah cheese with Utah wildflower honey and salt from ancient salt mines. Our next cheese is a power forward from Cypress Grove called Sergeant Pepper. This scrumptious pasteurized goat cheese is made in Humboldt County, California. This goat's milk cheese gets its kick from harissa, green curry, chili threads, and black pepper. Our next cheese is called Paulette and is made by Consider Bardwell Farm in West Paulette, Vermont. The cow's milk for Paulette comes from a nearby farm called Wayward Goose Farm. The salt and pepper fun continues in our pairing partners for our cheeses. We start out sweet with lush gourmet nuts, handcrafted salt and pepper peanuts with a really sweet taste. At Lush, they work in small batches, making their flavored peanuts and almonds so delicious. Besides eating the nuts with cheese, you can throw them on salads or give them a chop and sprinkle them on dessert. Take a look at the back of this bag of Appalachian salt and cracked black pepper chips. There are only four ingredients. And when these crazy people aren't making delicious, outrageous chips, they're busy recycling the dirt off their potatoes. Listen to the podcast for more. Friend and Cheese's Jam Comb makes us the most delicious salted watermelon jelly. It's like Membrio paste, but for summer. You're going to be fascinated by how interesting and delicious this is with all three of the cheeses in the box. That wraps up another curd box. A delicious collection of salt and pepper and tang and sweetness and deliciousness for your mouth. We hope you enjoy.